From the quiet settlement it once was to a thriving township it is today, the property landscape of Rawang has changed tremendously in recent years with the entry of many reputable developers which saw its potential to be the next property hotspot of North Klang Valley. Rawang falls under the municipality of Selayang and with a population of over 120,000 people in this primarily industrial township has given rise to the increase in demand for housing as reflected by the steady growth of property prices here at Rawang. However, these prices are very much lower than Kuala Lumpur's and that of its more popular neighbours, such as Kota Damansara, Setia Alam and Sungai Buloh, which makes it a more attractive option for property investors. However, these prices are very much lower than that of Kuala Lumpur's and its neighbouring popular neighbours such as Setia Alam, Kota Damansara and Sungai Buloh, which makes it uh, an attractive option for property investors. Of late, many amenities and commercial developments have been built in response for increase of demands of the residents here at Rawang. And in terms of accessibility, while well, Rawang is connected via several key expressways, including the Bandar Tasik Putri interchange to the Lata Expressway that is due to be completed later this year, and it provides even more connectivity and convenience to Rawang. All right, Jai, you have been a resident of Rawang for the past yep. 10 years. Yeah. Could you share your experience staying here for right. the past decade and any changes you've seen so far? Yes, definitely. I see a lot of changes over here. And moreover, for the past 10 years, it was quite diff different. And now we come to 2015, it's considered totally different. Because those days, people want to go to town. It's very difficult to get a bus. Moreover, no taxi transportation. And now we have buses and then we have a lot of transport over here. We need to go to KL also. It's quite in the nearby, whereby we have the KTM transportation, we can go to Kel. Whereby we have a lot of highways over here, and then moreover, those days we very difficult to go to the school for the kids. Don't have the transportation, we have to cycle or motorcycle. But now we have all of kind of the transport. We got a buses, school buses, van, everything. Those days it was a small road, and now the road also become huge. And then we have the flyover to exit to Bandar Country Homes also. So it seems pretty central and with that it has attracted a lot of property developers over here. I'm sure you noticed there are a huge amount of commercial developments going on. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so uh, asking about the prices over here. Oh, the, well, the prices okay. for sure. Definitely, okay. The prices is those days we can get an apartment, normal apartment, 30 to 40k. But now it's jumped up to 120 to 150. It's a normal apartment. So it's considered already 30% higher than the, those days price. Wow, fantastic. Yes, definitely. So I guess you are not going to move anywhere? No, definitely. I'm <laughs> going to stay forever in Rawang. It's a good place and a lot of development. And we have the shopping mall like a Jasco. And we have the Giant over here. And we have the Paxson. Everything is convenient. Mm -hmm. So I won't move to anywhere. Fantastic. <laughs> so a self-contained city. Yeah? Yes, very good. It's All a right. good place to live in over here. Okay, thanks, Jai. Okay. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. Right. All right, Aiden, yep. you have been a property agent for a while now and having served the township of Rawang, could you share with us your experience on what you think the progress is so far on Rawang Town? Okay, Rawang Town is um, already picked up, okay, then you spill over from Slayang and Kapong. Okay, the landed property in Rawang is still affordable uh, compared with PJ and Damansara, then uh, in which uh, Gated and guarded uh, concept. Okay. okay. Uh, then residents here can enjoy the two major highway like Lata and Kati. So in terms good of, in I see. So accessibility mm. is great. Mm. There are a lot of uh, developments going on in mm. terms of prices per square feet. Mm, there will be low five hundred per square feet still affordable. I see. Yeah. Okay. And as a property agent, have you seen quite a number of um, increase of demand? Uh, what is the percentage? In, in increase uh, more than 20%. Mm. Mm. Uh, uh, that's, that's why we say it's picking up. <laughs> what are your thoughts in the future of Rawang? Future Rawang, I think, uh, should be moving on because uh, in surrounding Slayang and Kapong, uh, not many land of less, so they will need to develop, they need to come over Rawang. Okay. Because Rawang still have a lot of land, can come over and develop. Okay, okay. Well, fantastic. Thank you so much for okay. sharing. You're welcome. Yeah. Faiz, you've been staying in Rawang for the past couple of years. What made you move here? Ya, saya sudah stay sini dalam 2 hingga 3 tahun juga. Jadi daripada apa yang saya nampak 
daripada dulu dawang dulu sebuah pekan koboi juga ah. sekarang saya sudah 2 3 tahun tengok sekarang sudah membangun jadi banyak tarikan lah jadi saya rasa bila saya pindah sini saya rasa tak menyesal lah bila dah dapat tawaran kerja kat sini belakang saya semua ada mm -hmm. ah, jadi shopping. Ah, shopping anything i can get here so bila rasa kat sini rawang ni makin lama makin maju lah jadi in terms of accessibility is it convenient to get out and into rawang are you far from your family ya yeah, very far <laughs> family saya memang stay johor jadi bila saya dapat tawaran kat sini mula-mula pun saya fikir dua tiga kali juga ah uh, sebab johor <laughs> rawang ke lah hmm. wah sangat jauh tapi bila lama-lama okey saja yeah, a lot hmm. of accessibility with the highways what is your favorite part about rawang ya yeah. <laughs> Anything ah, oh, everything. Uh, everything, uh. everything is here everything, in Rawang. Yeah, sekarang Rawang pun sudah membangun daripada. Ya, yeah, sebelum saya cakap tadi macam pakai koboi saja. Bila saya datang sini sekarang, anything I can get here. Mm -hmm. hmm. And it looks like it's going to grow, right? Yeah. What do you think it'll be like in five years time? <laughs> It, even uh, more. Even develop. more. Ya, yeah, betul lah. Jadi saya rasa mungkin akan datang saya akan lebih maju juga ah sama dengan pekan koboi makin lama makin maju saya pun akan maju juga ah yeah and your property prices will go up as well uh, insyaallah <laughs> okay thank you very much alright thank you